This meeting is being recorded. Good morning, sweethearts. Hello. Good Hello. morning. Tony. Good morning, everybody. Klaus, Kai, Hello. Felix, and Anon. <laughs> yeah. Uh, again, very happy to be here with you. Uh, I must confess, I don't know why. So for no reason or for every reason. And uh, I'm just curious to see uh, what is going to be expressed there from all those beautiful faces. Um, very individual, very unique. And uh, this is in a way the beauty. This is how I see it here. Yeah, just, just feel free. Otherwise, you know me, I'm blubbering the whole time. <laughs> so here, the stage is yours. Yes, Rosa. First thing I want to say that sometimes I spend the f um, five minutes in, in watching videos on the YouTube about uh, non-dual meetings. And lately I was very impressed by Felix. Because, yes, Felix oh. gives the impression here to be such an open person, you know. And so I was curious to... To, to listen to him. Klaus, the, there is Klaus, no particular... Klaus, by, the way, by, by the way, we had Zander Linchin and me uh, here. Greetings from Zander Linchin. Um, he is not going to manage. It's a lot of uh, things going on there. But otherwise, he would love, of course, to join. He is always joining. And we, but Klaus, we already did a, a, a Zoom also with Felix, if you're more interested. I saw, but, I saw, yes, I, I saw. saw. Okay, okay, beautiful. And, and that's why, that's why I, uh, you, you know, when when there is a non-dual speaker talking on the Zoom meeting, sometimes I listen carefully, sometimes I am more focused on the posture, position, uh, how you move, the, the way you look at the at the. Mm, computer or cell phone, whatever it is. And and I noticed this kind of uh, welcoming acceptance in Felix. So I said, oh yeah, that's a that's a cool guy. That's all. Yeah. yeah. I just wanted cool. to say my appreci appreciation towards this uh, kind of openness, or at least it's felt like that here, here you know. Here it's felt the same, by the way, Klaus. Uh, Felix is a very open guy, totally, and uh, booming out exactly the way he booms out. And this I, I appreciate very much. And yeah, that's cool. I love the directness, you know. Yeah. Yes. Totally. Felix. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you very much. As I understood, Klaus is an expert in gurus, so I'm very <laughs> flattered to, <laughs> to get this kind of feedback. <laughs> I'm not an expert anyway. By the way, it's okay. Yes. Klaus, sweetheart, do you want to put on your yeah, picture? Okay. Because you're disappearing with the picture from time. Yes, to yes. <clears throat> oh, good. I was just checking how many uh, guys and girls are here at the Zoom meeting to today. So I just controlling the the list of people. Yes, well, we are quite a number. Yeah, quite a number. Good. And Andrea was quite quite uh, close to hop in too, but she feels crappy a bit. So, uh, but in a way, I of course will also try to get another girl here. Otherwise, I'm the only one. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it, do it, yes. But okay, who Girls cares? are welcome. <laughs> who cares? Yeah, cool. <laughs> so about this feeling of uh, acceptance, yes, I notice uh, a lot this. Um, I can recognize by uh, looking at a person uh, if uh, th if that person is uh, open or or not, I if he's or she's on the pedestal or not, she's playing the role of the teacher of the of the professor that knows everything, or if he or she is open to more to listen, more to welcome people, m more to uh, open and uh, let them people uh, talk freely, you know. So. It's all about that. So that's why I said Felix, yes. For me, Felix is openness. 
Here he arrives as openness. So welcome, Zander. Felix. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Zander would say my, my ears are bleeding. <laughs> no, 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 no. We actually, Felix, actually we don't know what Zander Lynchin is going to say, but this may, of course, uh, happen innocently. So, and again, this, this might I, be some co concepts for his ears that he would probably like very much. And, and I really I really love uh, the characters like Klaus, you said, this openness. And just expressing very authentically whatever this means. You cannot escape yourself, man. Fuck it. You cannot. So be, like Karen is saying, be the asshole you already are. And, yeah, and yeah, this, yeah. I, love. this I love. This I love. This I love. The yeah. complete full expression. And, and Klaus, I, I get you when you say you can sense the openness. Or if someone is a, I, I, once I called a very, um, uh, uh, a guy which I very much love and appreciate. I just called him um, a professor of consciousness because it was so <laughs> obvious how much he knows. And this was so beautiful. You know, I could only see the beauty, but there was no interest to listen anymore. And mm -hmm. also like uh, in a way you feel also the arrogance uh, uh, very quickly. And, and this is also full on innocently playing out, full on innocent at play like um like yeah what to say everything is it everything is it no matter how it it's expressing Kai. yeah i think i think i think we were talking i think we were talking about the uh the the concept of of touching and um here there's uh like like a kind of of uh, picture um, because Klaus was talking about kind of openness and like if they were seeking about openness and we, we talked about like, like everything is this openness. And at the moment you, you seemingly touch something, it, it materializes. So out of nothing. So, so it gets like a form. It's like, it's like a magic. It's like wonderland. You, you touch something and it seems to appear in nothing so so everything is this openness i think that's that's what what we're talking about and, and in the moment that you seemingly like being it's getting like something and then it's disappearing again so that's just what's yeah, pops nice, up, pops up nice here. how you put it <laughs> uh, yeah yeah that's the beauty right that's the wonder that we are able to imagine, to 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 think about stuff which is not there, to make it real, even though it's not there in a way. And this is the magic. This is the joy. Every yeah, idea. and the kind of and the kind of recognizing that that uh, there is no real person that is even witnessing the character. So so every every. All this stuff seems to appear and to disappear, and yeah. Nice, Tony, sweetheart. You want to add something to this, or maybe completely different? Doesn't matter. No, yes. About this, uh, first of all, I also appreciate and recognize the openness uh, in all of you, and that that's amazing. Eh? Of course. And at the same time, um, thinking about the intuition, uh, each one we we have our own intuition, no, so to speak. That's what's happening here. Yeah, and it's very curious because we are not choosing, no, the likings and the dislikings. And for sure, if we if we were speaking about speakers. Uh, here, each one has different likes and dislikes. Someone for me is direct, open, and I tr I trust. And so another, with no reason, suspicion, prevention. And why? Th that's not why. Why not? It's why only not? Because uh, yes. Yeah, it's yes. just how the cookie Why crumbles. <laughs> exactly. And, and that's amazing. Here happens. 
sometimes prevention. Wow, and brrr, no, 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 no. All, uh, it's all, everything is fake, 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 fake. <laughs> and, and why? Innocent, innocent. <laughs> but it, it's what happened. Yeah, and it's full on, control. full on, full and on, full yeah. on, full on. Always has been like this, mm -hmm. but now without, uh, without shame or without uh, brrr. No filter. Very direct. No filter. Yes. Not listening to this, maybe also yeah. also saying, sharing with oh, I I don't like this. What a bullshit! Yeah. What a crap! Why not? Why not? You know, and all those concept of to be to be a nice person, not talking bad about others. So what? I don't care. I I feel free to 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 say whatever is popping up, and sometimes yes. I'm not saying anything. Yeah, why should you know? There is no need. For, for 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 anything and yeah what to say and even adding sometimes a story you know uh, I don't like this because of this and because of this because uh, this 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 way of that but we don't know we are making stories that are beautiful stories <laughs> beautiful <laughs> so beautiful. strange so weird and so so beautiful and and tony we can we can simply laugh together about the stories if you share then maybe uh, uh your friends can laugh with you about it or also cry about it why not this is so wow. beautiful yeah <laughs> yeah yeah i love sharing i simply love sharing yeah for no reason yeah, we can say that in many cases, uh, it's our impressions to determine if a, pers if a person is liked or not, okay? It, the, the, there is no uh, real reason. So sometimes you can say that the person is immediately liked by the other person, and maybe after, the person is searching for reasons trying to put it logical, you know? Yeah. But we have to admit that sometimes the same person can uh, create reactions in other people around him or around her, and the reaction are all the same. So in that case, we could consider the fact that the person itself has a, a certain behavior qualities, characteristics that uh, create, so to speak, the shared reaction in the people around. Yes. So it's not only uh, about uh, uh, individual points of view. I love that person. I don't love that person because here there is something activating by itself. Sometimes it's not so personal. Sometimes a reaction, my reaction, is similar to the reaction of many other people around. Why? I'm not searching for causes and um, motivations, but I tend to say that maybe it's the person itself. If, if a non-dual speaker is um, there at this position in front of his computer and continuously interrupts you uh, saying or claiming his own truth. Of course, there's going to be a reaction, a shared reaction among all the, the other people in the Zoom meeting. And likely, it's going to be the same. So it's not all about my personal reaction or my likes and dislikes. It could be also the person itself. You know, the, the, the internet, the YouTube, it's very crowded with people that uh, speak absolute statements and they give them for granted. But in the same time, they say, oh, I'm not a teacher. There's nobody in here to be enlightened. I'm yeah, no one. Yeah, that was beautiful. Uh, this, yesterday, this popped up. I heard a very famous uh, radical uh, non-dual speaker saying um saying like the same blah blah what was it exactly what is looked for what is looked for is of course the the death 
or the not me. <clears throat> so in, in here, automatically, even though I have no issue with the speaker, yeah, I, I love, in a way, I love everybody. But uh, this was automatically, oh, wow, how do you know? How do you know? <laughs> You know, <laughs> yeah. I mean, this is just so beautifully. Uh, mm -hmm. And then, of course, at the same time saying, well, uh, I don't know. Yeah. But but this is yeah. like very straight ahead. What is looked for is this, you know, and then, mm -hmm. of course, resonating with this message, you think, oh, yeah, yeah, sure. It's the me. Well, what is the problem? Yeah, of course. You know, the natural reality is the no me. Of course it is. <laughs> Boom, the next carrot. So beautiful, you know? You see this this magic game? Nothing wrong with this, nothing right with this. It's like a party. It's a big party. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Full Enjoy on party. Yeah. yeah, totally. <laughs> By the way, Anand, sweetheart, if you want to share something, feel free. You can also write in the chat or not. Of course not. <laughs> I just wanted to mention. Kai, do you want to share something? Yeah, uh, about this um, <clears throat> this this thing about the, the resonance, which I it's one of my favorite words. <laughs> Reson everything is resonance, you know. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's funny, you know. If you you meet somebody, just like you know, all of a sudden you meet, and, and it, you know, there's an there can be an instant resonance, an instant resonance, and it can be mutual or or nothing. You know, so it's not not in the mind. You know, this is something totally energetic, and uh, it just it can happen instantly, and often does. And um, yeah, so this is something um, energetic, and um, in a way transpersonal, I guess. And and it's um, and then uh, of course, uh, and then the other thing about openness. Um, yeah, it's part of the play is, you know, there's the opening and then there's the, the contracting, opening and contracting, you know, and, and of course, when there's the contracting, people start getting uneasy and this, you know, the, the, you know, the shadow starts to come up and it's like difficult to deal with the contraction after the opening, but it's all part of the play, opening, contracting. It's all part of the play. Whatever mm -hmm. this means. Whatever this means, yeah. Yeah, in a way, you see, uh, just saying those words, opening, contracting, openness, energy. Yeah. Let's yeah, let's okay. take out the meaning of those words. It's just blah, mm -hmm. blah, you know? It's just blah, blah. So um, what does it mean that this is energetic resonance? You know? This is so... Well, it, you, it, you can't analyze it with the mind. You see, you cannot yeah. analyze it. This is the beauty of it. It's something energetic. It, it's beyond the mind. It's just... There is resonance or there isn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Totally, totally. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what I meant. So, yeah, I, I, I know Just it was just like coming out very uh, naturally playing out mm -hmm. the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Always. Yeah. And a lot of times when we don't like some speaker, for example, uh, at the beginning we think about some words, no? We analyze these words. I don't like this word because blah, 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 blah. But it's energetic, if energetic meant something. Mm. Are not words. It's something inexprimable, yeah. but it's very clear. And this is personal, and it is not. Because everything yeah. is personal, and everything is not. No, Klaus? Yeah. How how to say this is personal and this is not personal? What happened? Yeah, right. We could say it's personal. No, everything is personal because it happens here, near here. No, uh, it's what happens. Yes, Odin. I agree with you mm, when you say personal, not personal. It's just words. You know, here, here, it, it can feel very, very personal. Here, it can feel that there is a strong sense of me doing thing. But of course, it's life expressing as me feeling myself. So in the end, the, the main character is life itself, of course. But there's nothing wrong in feeling very, very separated, contracted form of energy. Now I'm using the words of Tony Parson. Tony Parson says that 
The, the sense of me is a contracted form of energy. How does he know? Mm. My question, how does he mm. know? Have you ever been there to measure? How, how can you state that everything is made of energy? Uh, can you say that the wall is energy walling or that the table is energy tabling? You never went there to measure and to uh, verify for sure, scientifically, that the table is made of energy. So I am very, I am very curious to know how is it possible for for uh, Tony Parsons, Kenneth Madden to speak about energy all the time. In the same time, uh, Tony Parsons, Kenneth Madden, they're just this. They are an expression of this. So for me, it's very beautiful yeah. to listen, to to know, to to participate, to share. Because, yeah, that's life doing it. Beautiful. That's a beautiful show, you know. So in the end, I'm not even interested in, the, in proving that everything is made or not made of energy. I don't even get it. I don't, I don't even want to know it better. Because for me, it's enough, the, the, the sharing, the interaction. Mm -hmm. So yeah. that, that's, what, that's what I mean when I say openness. It's not my openness. It's not my decision to be open, but there's openness because everything that is arising now is like open by itself. It's not restricted, it's not contracted, it's not limited or censored. Just openness. Is, it is what it is. Then there can be Klaus say, oh, but I don't like it. Fuck. Or maybe... Klaus saying, oh, beautiful, I love it. But in all cases, I'm not doing it. It's just happening. Beautiful. I yeah, call it yeah. booming aliveness. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm feeling separate. It's not separation. Ben, I'm um, uh, wondering what this guy is saying this. Why do you know this? No, it's not knowing. And the proof is this mouth says a lot of things without knowing at all. I love to say this is nothing being everything. But I don't understand. I don't know this. <laughs> but, but, but please say this is the absolute appearing as a relative. This is everything and nothing at the same time. Who knows this? No, here, the here there's not knowing, absolutely not knowing. But at the same time, the happiness of sharing this, this craziness and this certainty, no? Doubtless uncertainty. Wow. Beautiful. Paradox, craziness, craziness, no? We are fed up with, with seriousness and sensitivity and sensitivity and things rational, logical, bad, it's, that, that's bullshit. No, let's to be crazy and say things for the, for the joy of saying nothing and everything at the same time, the opposite at the same time, both and either, yes, let's say without knowing, without knowing, it's personal this, well, I don't know, personal and not personal at the same time. Wow, beautiful. celebration. Beautiful, Tommy, beautiful. Mm -hmm. I can totally hear, for example, totally feel it. Totally feel mm -hmm. what you're saying. And here it's the same playful uh, way uh, when, when here apparently gathered into the Zoom on the so-called non-duality channel. It's just nonsense. It's just celebration of whatever, of whatever is coming up, because it's everything. And um, that's the surprise. The whole time. You have no fucking clue what's going to come up or not. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I have to confess that there is a certain amount of uh, pleasure in being here. I, I perfectly know that there is there is nothing important going on here. We are not discussing the future of the world. <laughs> but in the same time, it, it, even though it, there is a recognition, there is a total nonsense, 
there is an enjoying and the, the pleasure of sharing. So for me, it's not even so important if we say important or not important or meaningful or not meaningful um, topics. The pleasure of being here. That's it. Yep. Yeah, well, that's it. it. Yeah. Very simple. Felix. <laughs> yes, very, very nice. Very nice. I totally agree. And, uh, and, and, and what a great nonsense to think or, or to speak about the, the future of the world. <laughs> this is a tool. We can do it. Of course we can. Yeah, no, no. I, I, I just when, when, when I see seemingly other people or politicians or whatever speaking about the future of the world, it's, uh, it's, it's funny in a way. So, yeah, yeah. Even, even though, even though there's some seemingly involvement in some concepts or whatever concepts that are shared or 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 even fought uh, fought for to to get some people to see these concepts but it's empty it's empty so yeah it's so beautiful and full on full on going for the thing you know full on um ein ziel verfolgen how is it called felix uh go to for go. a goal to go for your goal, you know, you have a goal, you want to make the world a better place, you want to help people out of suffering, you want, uh, because you think that you are enlightened, you want to give, to give, you know, th this is the beautiful arrogance here in, in this place, let's put it, but this is at the same time so beautifully innocent, you know, and there is simply uh, no escape. And considering this is bullshit and wrong and not liking this, is this already? It's the same innocence. So, uh, yeah. And I love this. It's beautiful. And in a way, that's why here it's maybe coming out. Uh, follow your highest excitement. You cannot escape it. Escape it. What about what about the topic here in this non-dual area, needing confirmation, listening to all this crap, because I I'm not sure if I got it, and I simply need a confirmation. Uh, <laughs> what's coming up there? Yeah, it's true. It's true. There's a lot of people searching for for confirmations. Yeah, it's all about that. Yeah, from, from the guru, they, yeah, from the guru. Yeah, yeah. I need the okay, the okayness from uh, this and this and this in in order to to be able to to go on in this life, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yes, all, all the business of, of, of spirituality yeah. is based on uh, the fact that you, if you go to the next uh, um, um, ashram or appointment and you, you you can meditate with a new teacher that is going to give you a new method to reach something and then you spend your money in trying to reach something and and the the, the business of spirituality is all about also the fact that i don't tell completely the, the content of my perspective as a guru because i have to uh, give it to you drop by drop through the time so you can come to the next retire you know so to the next appointment and and uh, give me your money little by little piece by piece yeah it, it's business it's simply business yeah. it's, yeah, it's yeah. all is business and it, this is and then, so and obvious then it, yeah it, it it can happen that uh, from from a certain point you don't give a shit about all this uh, understanding. There is nothing to understand. There is not interest in in getting it anymore or to reach into some goal because the it's pretty meaningless. It's for for no reason. At a certain point, it comes out uh, spontaneously that uh, it's all about nothing. So there is no need to improve, to get better, to be qualified, to be a lama or a guru or a sadhu. It's not important. There's no need at all. So yeah. in the end, it, it's 
that you, you you don't I, I'm talking about my personal story, of course. From a certain moment, the so-called moment, there was no more interest in uh, reading books or listening to the Lama's words or going to the pujas or the sadhanas. Yeah. And now we yeah. can say yeah. why. Now, now we can make a beautiful story out yeah. of this and say, yeah. why that? How is this happening? You know? So a lot of people in a way are exactly looking for this uh, stopping of the seeking, you know? Mm. Because the seeking energy, whatever this is, again, yeah. just bullshit, is apparently the, the problem. No, it's not. <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> and um, and here when you said when I saw that of course, it's all about nothing. Here it was like, well, uh, it's what it is. The pain in the ass oh, yeah. is ready. Boom. Hello. You know? <laughs> yes, yes. But here the words doesn't help, you know. Yeah. How to how to express this concept with words. It's they they, they don't fit. All, all the times you say you try to say something, it's about something. So what is this something? Okay, so you say it's about nothing. Okay, show me this nothing. Yeah. It is what it is. Okay, show me this. Yeah. What you're talking about. So you, you see that if you if you try to analyze every single word in a sentence and go deeper, they all they all I don't it, know wrong or inappropriate somehow. The, no, no, no. This is it already in the direct. Yeah, no. This it's the trying to express to explain to yes. go from. Hölzchen to Stöckchen. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm lacking the English vocabulary, which is it too. Every misunderstanding is it, you know? And that's the joke. This is the yeah, immediacy yeah. of what is. That there is nothing more to add to it. And you can make bubble gums, beautiful stories out of it, of course. Yeah, but there are teachers like uh, if you talk about, oh, okay, tomorrow, uh, wait, 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 there is no tomorrow. There is only now. Okay, sorry. So yesterday I went to the, the grocery. Oh, but there is no yesterday. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> you know, on the relative level, oh, there's no such a thing as relative level. <laughs> okay. So let me say that. I just went, I decided to buy. There is no I to decide anything. <laughs> so, so you understand that if you, if you take the non-duality, uh, from the perspective of what he, what we can say or not say, it's not possible to talk. So my decision <laughs> here, even though there is no one to decide anything, of course, it, it, it was like, I just flow. I just flow, no matter what, you know? And that's freedom, yes. I feel mm -hmm. more relaxed. You know, in the Advaita in India, Advaita, uh, they never say... Uh, I am upset. They say here there is a sensation of being upset. I'm not thirsty. They don't say I'm I'm thirsty. They say uh, here there is the need to drink a glass of water. Here yeah. there is the need. Yeah, Never and, say I. Yeah, 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 Otherwise, yeah. you 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 could be kicked off from the community. You know. Yeah. I mean, can we live with this fear in the background? Not to say the right word at the right time. Is it well, worthy? That's it. that's it already. That's it already. Yeah, Buy, yeah. Buying this it's... shit and believing that this is it. Saying instead of I like it or here is uh, 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 not liking it. <laughs> that's it. For me here in this uh, European area, because in a way we have different uh, cultures. So I can totally uh, understand when in Asia the expression is different than here. But here, in yeah. this, you know, when, when someone is starting with here, and here is this, I'm just like, okay, baba, <laughs> enjoy. Enjoy the here and the now and whatsoever. But uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what? When you say it's this already, it sounds familiar to me. It's very, I, I like the, this expression. But uh, in, in the certain, uh, um, at a certain level, it's like to say, uh, the sky is blue. Yeah, you know what, the, si the sky is blue. And then you say, hey, yeah, I want to uh, navigate through clouds and take a trip from here to New York by plane. Yeah, yeah but, you, but you know what, you have to pass through the sky, which is blue. And, and you repeat <laughs> again and again and again. It is what it is. Already done, just this perfection in action. The sky is blue. Yeah. So what? 
And that's why when, when we talk in private uh, among uh, non-dual speakers, sometimes we finish talking about private life, how to plant a tree, how, how to clean the engine or your uh, automobile, you know, but because it, it's not possible to imagine that we continue also in private chats to talk about, oh, you know what? Yeah, but just this, my, my engine, it was not not working today, early in the morning, I had to go to work and the new don't do a speaker could answer. Yeah, but it's just already this. Can we go on like that? For me, there is no there is no reason reason to clarify or repeat continuously. Just this already this perfection in action. It's Thank obvious. You. Yeah, Klaus, beautiful, beautiful. Let me read from Anand. Before we go into part two, everyone who wants, yeah. just feel free because we are going to be kicked out in about two minutes. Pro prob for... Probably Anand could, could, could speak. It's very hard to read this long, uh, long uh, I, I, I writing. Don't, I, don't, I don't want to force him. So Anand, just uh, tell me yes or no. Do you want to read it by yourself? Or shall, uh, shall I read it? Or Kai or whoever? <clears throat> whoever. Okay. Kai, do you want to read this? Um, well, sure. Um, <clears throat> so, uh, he says here, it's okay for me to listen. Thanks. I have been to various Indian gurus, Abdhut, Shivananda, Nichananda, Pyramid Meditation of Patriji Vipassana, 10 days, brought discipline, brought a sense of wonder and disgust by getting the, themselves and me into scams. Started my journey with chanting and Osho books, then visited a few gurus who offered LOA and Shaktipat mix. Then unable to manifest desired lifestyle and I moved to next. Visited mix of gurus and businessmen model with twist of scam of Nityananda. Bida D. Bangalore, stayed there for a few months and later scandal broke there and he left India. Then read Krishnamurti and UG and then to Nandu and then, yeah, UG, yeah, and then to non-duality culture. Seeking being, meaning is on. Seeking being, meaning is on. Whoever. Yeah, beautiful boom, Anam. <laughs> Thanks for sharing all the beauty. Wow. That's it. That's it. That's it. And it's mm -hmm. always like this. And it's never gone. Mm -hmm. No escape. There is simply no fucking escape and there is no need. And escaping this, trying to escape this, is this already. This is this is so beautiful, innocently uh, playing out like this expression here, they're sharing. It's just this. Mm -hmm. It's just a sharing. It's just the bloody sharing, meaning nothing at all already. <laughs> Sweethearts, if you like, let's go in part two. You like? Mm -hmm. Okay, if you like, I like too. So see you there.